Hey, it's Dave from Bullpen Cycles, and this is a 95 Ducati Monster. Now here's what I like about these lights. Look at this. Just the way they fit. Just enough sporting, but not too much. Oh. I guess I better put her away, huh? Second year of the first generation groundbreaking Ducati Monster. Oh, I've had this bike. I just like every other one. I've had this bike for 10 years. Well, it's probably true. I finally got around to finishing it. Had some help with the valve adjustments. I don't do Desmo valves. Belts are fresh. Only thing not stock on this bike is the Corbin seat. And I think there's a K&N air filter element. Here's the cool thing. This is what they considered high tech in 1995. This digital tachometer, watch. Ooh. 26,500 miles, which I guess that's not a lot now, but when I bought it 10 years ago, that seemed like a lot. Fresh battery in this. Just did fork seals, brakes, carbs. Probably more, so we're gonna ride it. I show you something, England's gonna go nuts. But here's what I like about these lights. I told you. Hey! Hey! Here's what I like about these lights. Look at this. Just the way they fit. Just enough sporting, but not too much. Oh. I guess I better put her away, huh? It's too nice today to keep her penned up. But boy, she can be obnoxious. Inga. Pardon the interruption. Anyway, here's what I like about these bikes. They fit. Skinny where it needs to be, short where it needs to be, sporting where it needs to be, sitting up where you can still push with your knees, and yet, it's not painful. It's comfortable. And you still get that classic Ducati V-Twin sound. Six gears with a 9,000 RPM red line. Freaking awesome. So I gotta get my helmet and we're gonna go for a ride.
I had it running a second go, but it's not quite warm. I'm going to let it warm up a little bit yet. Uh-oh. School's letting out. Here you get a glimpse of my high-tech dashboard. That was like a $350 factory option. Okay, my back brakes went. That's going to be in the caliber because I replaced the master cylinder once. And we're going to turn around. No, we're not going to turn around. There's a school bus. Uh-oh, no U-turn. Shoot. I think I screwed up. Is it on that side too? No. Okay. Well, I'm not going to do a U-turn here. So the thing about these bikes is... I mean, you're sitting up where you're supposed to with your knees that you can push on the tank. Yet it's not crazy. You got that wonderful 9,000 RPM red line that I'm not going to do on a side street and get my neighbors pissed off. But you've seen me do that before. Easy to find neutral, even with the dry clutch. Sounds like it's going to blow up. I didn't know if there was sand on the road there or not. Woohoo! Man, these things pull like a tank. Gonna get me in trouble. Ooh, I got a Mustang to race. 35? You're killing me. speed limit. Ah. Well, we know it works.
right turn signal switch is flaky. You got to hold it on. Oh, now it's staying on. <laughs> 